The sun dipped beneath the horizon, casting a golden glow across the vast expanse of the island as it met its nightly retreat. The waves whispered their secrets to the shore, and the coconut trees swayed in the tropical breeze, their leaves rustling like the whisperings of old lovers. In this lush paradise, away from the prying eyes of society and the mundane trappings of everyday life, there existed an oasis of passion, a haven where desires ran wild and love knew no boundaries. It was here that our story unfolded, in the warm embrace of the honeymoon phase. The first rays of dawn heralded the arrival of our protagonists, Aiden, a dashing young entrepreneur with an air of mystery about him, and his exquisite new bride, Lila. She was an enigma herself, a captivating blend of cultures, her eyes as deep and dark as night, and her skin the color of fresh, sun-kissed coffee. As they disembarked from their private seaplane, the locals couldn't help but marvel at the beauty of this exotic new bride. The island, it seemed, would be their sanctuary, a cocoon in which they could explore the depths of their love without fear or reproach. Hand in hand, Aiden and Lila ventured forth into the island's verdant heart. They discovered hidden coves where the ocean's gentle lullaby soothed them, and secret caves adorned with stalactites that glistened like diamonds in the flickering light of glowworms. They danced under the stars, their bodies entwined as one, their passion a wildfire that consumed them both. With each whispered word and tender touch, they fell further under the island's spell, their love growing stronger by the day. But in this tropical paradise where fantasies came to life, there lay hidden dangers. Unbeknownst to Aiden and Lila, the island was home to other travelers seeking respite from their mundane lives. Among them, a sultry siren named Isadora. She was the embodiment of temptation, a seductive blend of mystery and allure that could not be ignored. As she slinked into their orbit, her gaze smoldering with mischief, it became clear that this honeymoon phase would take an unexpected turn. Isadora's arrival ignited a fierce competition between the newlyweds, a game of love in which each vied for the other's affection. Lila found herself torn between Aiden's adoration and Isadora's seductive whispers, while Aiden wrestled with his own desires. As the days passed, their once simple love story became an intricate dance of passion and betrayal, a tango of lust and jealousy that left no heart unscathed. In the heat of this passionate battle royale, it was only a matter of time before someone's heart would be irreparably shattered. And when push came to shove, Aiden made the ultimate sacrifice, to walk away from the island and his own desires, leaving Lila to make her choice. Would she choose the safe harbor of her husband's love, or risk the tempestuous sea of passion that lay between her and Isadora? Epilogue. The honeymoon phase, like all phases of life, eventually drew to a close. The sun set on Aiden and Lila's idyllic sojourn as they stood at the crossroads of their future. But even in the fading light of their love story, there remained a glimmer of hope, a reminder that passion could always find its way back home, no matter how far it had wandered. The End